Hello everybody. So, first and foremost, I'm using a different camera. Um, my boyfriend gave me his camera because he loves me. And because my phone camera is a little wah wah. So this is going to be kind of a haul. Um, it's another bead box that I have subscribed to. And it's called Blueberry Cove Beads. I don't know if this camera takes a minute to focus, so give it a second. So yeah, blueberrycovebeads.com. Um, and I think, let's see, the, the it's like a different theme every single month. And this time it's vintage floral. And then sometimes they have challenges, which is cool. And um, let's just get right into the goodies. So the first thing are these two. Let me take it out of the bag because the glare, I'm sure, does not help um, being able to see the beads. Or in this case, two little charms. So these are shells. Um, Give it a second to focus. If I pull them back here. Yeah, so it looks like they're painted. Uh, yeah, and then they've got the holes on the top. There's two of them. And then, um, oh, and I paid... I think 27 a month for this one, and this one actually ships from overseas, so I can't remember where it is, maybe Sweden or somewhere, I'm not sure. And then I've got four of these clasps, which are, I'm guessing they're plated, but that's fine, because they're pretty. So there's four of those, my bags are all sticking together, I'm trying to pull things out of the bag so that you guys can actually see see them because the glare is pretty bad. And then there's these beads. See if it'll actually focus. Maybe. Sorry guys, I'm trying to figure out this new camera. Not sure how to get it to focus either. You can kind of see. They're, um, they're kind of like flower beads. I don't know what to call these, but they're metal beads. I think they're roses, maybe? Not sure. And then there's these, which I'll take these out as well. Maybe I'll just take everything out because obviously this camera does not like focusing with glare. So, um, I'm guessing they're like a check bead. Um, they're faceted, and they're like this dusky rose color-ish. Yeah, I don't know what to call that, but they're really pretty. Um, no idea what I'm going to use them for, mind you. I never have any idea when I get stuff. I just get stuff. And there's these beads. I'm tired of taking things out of the bag, but it's not going to focus. <sighs> Sorry, guys. It's going to be one of those videos. I didn't sleep very well last night, so I'm a little cranky. So these are really pretty. Um, they're glass beads with... I think they're roses, again. I think they're little rose. If I go slowly, then it focuses. Kind of. So they're like little rose paintings on there. And there's six of those. I don't know if I'm going to continue with this one, just because um, the other boxes that I get, I feel like I get a lot more. And I pay less. And I understand, you know, the shipping and whatnot, but... And then there's these. I think these are plastic. There we go. And it looks like a rose and something or other. And then there's these charms, which are really cool. Um, they've got that, like, green... I think they call it verdigris. 
Sorry about the glare. I don't feel like taking things out of the bag, though. And then four of these. See, like, I don't know. I feel like getting four beads is just kind of pointless. And then there's these charms, which I did get a few of these charms, which are really cute. Um, and then I got two strands of beads. There's this one, which I think is a rutilated quartz, which is pretty cool, um, I think. But I, I haven't looked it up yet to see exactly what it is. And then these, which look like a smoky topaz, but they could be a glass bead. If I can get it to focus on the beads. Alright, there we go. Um, so yeah, I'm not sure if these are glass or what, but that's all I got in this bead box, and like I said, it's a Blueberry Cove Beads, and I'll put the link down below just in case anybody's interested, um, and that's all for right now, I'm trying to get things together to get a sale going because I'm trying to not have to work 12 to 15 hours a day, it's kind of getting to me at this point, so I will make a video at some point soon, and I will talk to everybody. And later. Bye.